so now this is a question from the chapter solutions and he is asking the mixture shows the positive deviation from Raoult's law first one is benzene plus toluene now benzene plus toluene will show or I should say that it will make ideal solution as per the NCERT right acetone and chloroform as per the ncrt they will show the negative deviation third one chloroethane and bromoethane they will show the ideal behavior right ethanol and acetone they will show the positive deviation from raoult's law right so fourth is the correct answer right let's move on to the next question so now this is a question based on the nature of oxides so we have to match two columns in first column oxides are given other column the nature of oxide is given so we all know that carbon monoxide is neutral barium oxide is basic aluminium oxide is amphotric and cl2o7 is acidic in nature so the correct answer will be option number one so the answer is option number one right let's move on to the next question so now in this question is asking which of the following has the maximum number of atoms so all are the elements if you find the number of moles higher is the number of moles higher will be the number of atoms so we have to find out the number of moles of atoms and this belongs to the mole concept that is the first chapter of the class 11th that is some basic concept of chemistry right so let's find out the solution number of moles of atoms in the case of magnesium that is the first one for magnesium number of moles of atoms that is 1 the given weight divided by 24 this is the number of moles of atoms and second one is oxygen so for oxygen the number of moles of atoms that will be equal to 1 by 32 given weight upon molar mass we have to multiply it by 2 because it is O2 right so this is the number of moles of atoms in the case of O2 third one is lithium so it will be number of moles of atoms of lithium that will be equal to 1 upon 7 right and the last one is number of moles of atoms of the last one is silver so it is ag and that will be equal to 1 upon 108 right so which one is the maximum 1 upon 108 1 upon 1 by 7 2 upon 32 or 1 upon 24 so we can see that this 1 by 7 is the maximum that's why third will be the correct answer we could multiply with the Avogadro number to find out the number of atoms of these elements right but if we know that higher is the number of moles of the atoms higher will be the number of atoms right let's move on to the next question